How are we doing today, guys? My name is Josh. I'm the mechanic here at Big Rig Chrome Shop. Kind of walk you around what we did on uh, one of our customers' trucks here. We started off with four inch trucks, LED lights. Uh, they're dual revolution. These particular ones uh, go from red to white. Next thing that we did was we started with cabin uh, sweeper panels or uh, stainless steel from Iowa Customs. They actually have uh, one inch uh, bullet lights on the bottom that we installed and wired up. Um, these are also dual rev as well. These are red as well, red and white as well. Uh, we'll kind of move up to the up to the cab panel here. The same thing here, what we did, and these were all stainless steel. Um, we actually stuffed them up and painted them uh, for, for request of the customer. Uh, we also did his box panels here, box covers. Uh, these were on his truck, he just asked us to paint them. Not a big deal for us to do. Uh, one of the next things that we did was our fenders. <laughs> We did uh, the fenders. Uh, these are from FiberTech. Uh, these were actually about four inches longer. We cut them down specific the way the customer wanted them um, and uh, painted those, did all the work on those. Uh, we'll kind of go back a little bit, forgot about these. We got the Phoenix air cleaner lights um, and uh, we've got the, the back and then the front. We, got, we did honeycomb on the front. The back is dual revolution, uh, the red and white as well. Um, and then we've got uh, your amber on the front. Uh, we'll kind of come around to the front here. We added two cab lights up top. Usually horns or whatnot are there. Uh, he wanted to fill those in, so we added cab lights for him. Replaced all the cab lights as well. Uh, we did a Roadworks uh, grill bar set for him, seven bars. Uh, put these on for him. Not too hard, pretty simple uh, standard setup. 